I guess his Burisma money ran out. Hunter Biden is apparently an artist now. He's selling his abstract works for as much as half a million dollars per painting. So who's buying this crap? Hunter's art dealer says sales are confidential, which is raising the question once again of whether the first son is selling access. Mm. Greg Gutfeld, influence well, peddling. Well, he went from one scam to another, but this one's better because before he was the guy that was having to explain why he didn't deserve six figures a month for a job he, in which he wasn't qualified for. Now he's going to have to try to explain why he doesn't deserve six figures for painting things that look like tramp vomit. I don't know if you've seen the pictures, but it's easy to be an imposter in this art world because they're all imposters, aren't they? It's like no one knows art and they play off everybody's insecurities so nobody really will say, yeah, that's not art. And they'll just say, oh, that's pretty good and maybe it's for influence. But even he's in on the joke because he paints with a straw. I love that. And once, and what is he oh. known for? You know, he used to snort blow with a straw. Now he uses uses to blow paint. That's like O.J. Simpson deciding to go to chef school and using the same knives. <laughs> I went, I majored in art history. You did? Oh, no wonder you're yes, here. Yes, and I know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and I know that there are a lot of stupid rich people who, who want to buy some access. <laughs> or smart rich people that buy some access. So you could have a Russian billionaire <laughs> hand the Biden family a half a million dollars and the Biden family just gives the guy a watercolor back. And we're not supposed to say, wait a second, the media has no clue what's going on here. That would be like Don Jr. taking up sculpting. And so he just whittles a little spear. You know, he's a hunter. He whittles the spear, and then so some <laughs> Russian gives him a half a million, and the media is going to say, oh, that sounds like it's a straight deal. Of course not. <laughs> They're violating every spirit of the law. I mean, what's this? It's got to be illegal to do this, right? It has to be illegal. Well, I'm sure the FBI would be interested in looking into it, given that they're invested, investigating his uh, taxes and other things. So, um, Harold, you were sitting in front of an uh, Andy Warhol mal painting one, at one time, <laughs> and you didn't know it was Andy Warhol. So what do you think of, as an amateur, what do you think of his art? Look, I, I, don't, I don't buy a lot of art. Um, but, but I don't that begrudge a guy. You know, but I don't <laughs> begrudge a guy uh, for trying to make a living. Yeah. And if if he's if it turns out there's something that's not above board here, I'm certain they'll find out. And based on your comments, Jesse, someone's probably going to look into it uh, this this afternoon. But I, I don't I don't begrudge a guy. Heck, maybe Hunter and and former President Bush may come together and do some do some Ooh, hard work together. Yeah, uh, yeah. And, and, and I don't think Bush is selling it to Saudi billionaires though. But we don't know who he's selling it to. Exactly, because they won't tell I don't you. Think President Bush I don't even is know if he sold anything. anything. <laughs> he's, oh, he's going to sell. Trust me. I just. We'll see. I think about like this: Who in their right mind would go and pay? And by the way, these numbers are just total BS right. because they just make them up. Eight and, six numbers. Right, exactly. <laughs> uh, but who would actually go and even spend five thousand dollars on one of these paintings and it, put it in their foyer, and then people come over and they're like, "Look at my Biden!" Look at my laughed out of town. I, I didn't think some of the paintings were that bad. I have to say, and I, I, when I was a kid, I used to love doing that blow art thing. I don't know if I was that good, but I, I kind of liked it. Is that what you called and it? And the art blow world. Art. <laughs> and the art world. I mean, th there's a lot of shady stuff that goes on in the art world. Mm -hmm. It's a lot. It's a place to hide a lot of money. Yes. Yeah. And so that's why this is maybe a little. A lot bit of brushes but, with the law. Oh, very good. Let's just end it right there. <laughs> yes. Let's hey, Sean Hannity here. Hey, click here to subscribe to Fox News YouTube page and catch our hottest interviews and most compelling analysis. You will not get it anywhere else.